So right here we have us a brand new Deer Valley home that you're definitely gonna wanna stick around and see everything on the inside of this one because it's spectacular. And when I say spectacular, I mean spectacular. Now I just gotta figure out what spectacular mean. <laughs> All right guys, I don't know, it's just, I'm on one today, it's beautiful weather. I'm at the home place, this is in Pinson, Alabama. I'm grateful they let me come video some of their amazing inventory. And it's a, it's a new Deer Valley. I mean, like they have some of the coolest homes out there. So anytime I get to video these, I'm beyond grateful. And with that being said, if this is your first time seeing the channel, know that we tour all types of homes like this. We have all types of homes on the channel. So be sure to subscribe to the notification bell. That's another new Deer Valley. I just did it. It'll be on the channel, may already be on there. Uh, but these are a couple models that they just got in. And I'm actually down here all right, see that? Let's, let me show you that real quick. You know what, I'm gonna wait till we get around there, but I wanna say the reason I'm actually here, okay? These guys actually live in a Deer Valley sitting on 40 acres, and I'm able to tour that. I don't know if it's been, I probably have maybe already put it up. And so that's why I came back down here, but in the meantime, I wanted to get some of their newer stuff and what i'm trying to get around to is that's why this house is not trimmed out typically you know they'd be trimmed out power and all that kind of stuff but these have just got set up and so i wanted to be able to get them while i was here but y'all just y'all know to look past that for those of you that are new viewers your vinyl and everything will be there once these homes are set up that that homes on the channel did really really well people loved it but you can do vinyl skirting uh you can do tin uh you can do brick there's a lot of different options I love they went with the tan windows on this one. Just did one while ago that had the tan windows with the tan vinyl. And this is more of a, I guess you'd call maybe like an olive with some outside plugs. And then, so this is what I was trying to get around to show you. Down here on this end, we have a side door. This home has a very unique floor plan. That's why another reason why I wanted to go ahead and get it while I was here. Let's head around, head into that front door. If you'll go ahead and drop us a big fat like on this video, I would really appreciate it. That's the only thing I'm gonna ask, I think. But yeah, that just helps these videos out so much if you would take the time to do that. And I always say, if you'll share these videos, so I guess that is the second thing I'm gonna ask, but yeah, sharing these videos helps a lot too, I believe. Let's walk inside. Y'all ready? What a view whenever you walk right into this front door. Now, like I'd mentioned, we don't have any power, so it's a little bit darker in here, but I've got my handy dandy light, so we'll be good to be able to see everything. And then also, it's not the home's not trimmed out right here. Let me just quickly go over for those of you that don't know. This home, uh, all this, all you know, obviously your interior walls won't be exposed or whatever, but I do want to show you, it's a cool thing to show, we have two by four interior walls in this house. A lot of a lot of manufactured and modular homes, you're not gonna see that. So that's good to see something Deer Valley does. And then obviously all your flooring uh, would, be would be covered there. Speaking of flooring, this is your LVT right here. Uh, really nice stuff, something that, that Deer, Va Deer Valley has in a lot of their homes. It's uh, just found out it is waterproof. That's cool to know, right? Love the beams that we have up top. I'm gonna say you're probably gonna have a beam coming right down through here and that's, you'll see where those connect once this house would be set up as well. So if you're looking at that and you're like, something about that just don't look rock. <laughs> I don't know what kind of accent that was. All right, seen enough of this living room, really good size, but I wanna talk about what's in here. I wanna talk about as we flow from that living room into this dining area, what you're looking at when you're looking at the dining room. What you're seeing is a real nice table covered with, uh, actually we've got six places to sit. You could go a little bit bigger on this table if you like. I don't know, if you went too much bigger then you wouldn't have ways to get around, so keep that in mind as well. But uh, overall, it's a really good size spot. Come back here in this corner so I can get a shot of everything. Got the really nice big island. We've got the same countertops. Uh, a lot of times you'll see the, the these countertops and the island countertops uh, different, but we've got the same throughout. And there's a lot of options and stuff on all that, I'm sure. 
we've got to take one quick second and check out this backsplash. Wonder how it got its name, backsplash. Like if water's splashing, I guess, or something. Something that won't get on your sheetrock, maybe? That's just to educate the guests. And I mean, I'm a pretty smart guy. Soft closed cadence is what you're gonna see standard in Deer Valley homes. Got the built-in microwave, Frigidaire, stainless steel appliances. You gotta love all those windows that you're gonna see right across there. Now, I'm gonna go down here Actually, let me make sure I get a shot of this sink. I do like to get in a hurry sometimes. I'm sorry, y'all. I just get so excited. I want to show you this, though. I mean, look at this. I love a good size utility room. But then when you throw a pantry in a living room, I mean, in a utility room, this is like top of the line. It really don't get any better than this. I mean, I guess a little bit bigger pantry could have really... You know, took it from a 10 to, you know, a 10.8, because nothing's 11, but yeah. There you have access to your water heater. And uh, this is that side door that we looked at on the exterior. I like the way they had this set up. So here's where your dryer would go and your washer. You've got cabinets above them and a nice rack. And then you've got this little countertop right here. Be, I, I feel like probably the way it's set up spot for your laundry baskets under there maybe. And then you've got a nice little folding table. That's what I'm gonna go with. And that actually goes into the main bedroom, but we can't go in there. We can't go in there just yet because there's a lot to see in there. All right, but what I am gonna do is, is head on down here, briefly show you these other bedrooms and this bath, and then we'll finish up, I mean, your second bath, and we'll finish up with the main bedroom. Y'all definitely be sure, I know I'm talking a lot, I'm sorry. Y'all definitely be sure to, to give me some feedback, leave me a comment, let me know what you think about the home. So this bedroom right here is on the front of the house. For those of you that was wondering about that. And it's got a good size closet. Very nice. I like when a when a guest bedroom or a kid's room has a has a you know just at least a good average size closet. I like that a lot. Got the same flooring in here. Then we've got the shower tub combo. I actually was just touring a home and talking about how their standard shower tub combos are typically bigger than what you would typically see. But I will say that's gonna be about what you would typically see. So I guess, I guess it's just a, a lot of the ones I've done there. Uh, I seen that really nice big shower tub combo in them. I was like, well, maybe that's just their standard. Maybe it is a standard. Maybe this is non-standard. <laughs> if you know what I mean. Huh? Huh? I don't know. I'm even, I'm confusing myself. We come back into this back bedroom. Hey, look at that right there. I toured that home the first time that I come here, but if you have not seen that house, it's called The Shallow. Uh, it's on the channel. You'll definitely recognize it. I think it says something about the perfect lake house, and it's got a picture of that porch as the thumbnail. Gonna wanna see that home. It's got quartz countertops, great looking house. Good size bedroom here as well. Keep in mind, same thing with the trim out, all, all your trim and everything would be there. Let's head down here and look at this main bedroom. So you've got a really good size room in here. 
I've seen some other homes in the past that have kind of the main bedroom positioned here. And what I've realized is you, a lot of times the bedrooms, it cuts down on their size because they're kind of right in the middle of the house. You know, it just seems like they're, they're smaller. But this one right here, for this size of a home, this is a very big main bedroom. I'll try to have some dimensions and all that for y'all as always. And there is where you have access into the laundry room. Now I'm going to, I'm going to walk you in here and show you, show you this bathroom. Double porcelain sinks, same countertops that we have there in the kitchen. And then we've got several cabinets and drawers and I got to open up these right here. I want to show these off. Soft clothes in here as well. And we've got a really nice tub and shower in here. Before we do that, I want to go ahead and show you this bath. And I know this video would probably be 10 times better if the power was on. But I just gotta say, I mean, I, I had to get it while I was here. I just, I'm being a little impatient, I know. All right, well, let's just start with this towel shower since we're coming from there. We do have a uh, seat in there. See somebody asking about that. Uh, saying I don't shoot low enough. Hey, I'll read the comments. I try to, if, if y'all, whatever y'all, you know, if it's, you know, some of y'all say some pretty ridiculous stuff. <laughs> Very rarely do I really see any like, really, really negative comments anymore, but uh, they're at the beginning, woo. It's like, I don't know if I can do this. This is a very cool floor plan. Thank you all so much for watching. My name is Chance, and if, and if this is your first time viewing and you're still watching, I'm just gonna tell you, you gotta subscribe at the notification bell, and you gotta check out the channel for some of the other homes that we have. Like, no doubt, this one's really cool. I wouldn't have videoed it if I didn't think you guys were gonna like it, but I've got some other just crazy homes on the channel i mean we've been doing this for a couple years now it seems yeah about two years almost and so i've got homes out the wazoo whatever that means don't forget to like this video if you will that really really helps us out a lot and lastly i'll ask if you'll share this video with someone that you think would like to see it thank you all right, so we got a lot to talk about this outro, so let's get right into it. First off, let me say, if you have not got you some of the new merchandise, link to that's in the description. Y'all be sure to check that out. There's some really comfortable shirts. We got all kinds of stuff on there in the description below. So I'm gonna give you some pricing and stuff like that, but first, I don't. I just like sharing this stuff with y'all. Y'all may not even care, so I, I mean, you can fast forward, but uh, I'm actually recording this on Friday, the, the previous Friday from when this video comes out on Tuesday. Uh, because I'm going to be gone all next week, like I told you in the last video, and I'm going to be shooting a lot more tours for y'all. And it's just, so I'm trying to stay ahead, and it's hard to really think about when this video is going to be coming out. But anyways, I wanted to go ahead and give you just a little uh, idea of what's, what's going on, where I'm going to be. And I think the first one, or first tour from there will probably be airing this Saturday night, hopefully. So I'm going to be in the, wait for it, Texas area i love texas i'm gonna be uh in a few different places though the cool thing is i'm not just gonna be at one dealership i'm going to several i mean i'm like like i said i'm gonna be shooting videos all week and like i told you in the last video i'm gonna be doing some really unique manufacturers and i'll share one of them here with you and uh, you can check them out if you want in the meantime but it's oak creek homes they build some amazing homes i cannot wait to tour them and share them with y'all. So all that's coming and I'm just super excited. Done book my flight. <laughs> I'm ready to get it. Let me say in the description of this video though, I have information on this particular home that we just toured. Uh, you can find all kinds of stuff in there. Also in the description, 
we will have our website link and I don't know if you kind of caught it, but this is actually a home that I toured a little while back. Uh, but I've been kind of hanging on to it, waiting for a good time to put it out. Uh, because I try to put up a, a, a lot of different stuff. And I've been putting up several Deer Valley, so I thought I'd wait a little bit and then put this one out. But anyways, if you want to be able to find this home in your area uh, or something like it, use our website link. It's in the description. That's been created just for, for people just like you, maybe that's in the market looking to purchase. We want to do our best to help you find this home or something like it in your area. The website link will be in the description, like I said. Now let's get into talking about some pricing on this home, but an unusual thing, like I was telling you, um, since I actually recorded it versus now, the pricing has changed a little bit. So that's what I really want to want to hone in on for you guys if you're watching this six months, a year down the road. This pricing and stuff has probably changed. There's so many other factors I can't account for, but I'm gonna give you pricing for right now and it, it basically just ballpark figures about what you can get this home for. There's options you can add or take out in this home. There could be freight charges, county regulations, a lot of factors, y'all know I, I say it all the time, but this will give you a really good idea. That's all it is. It's just what's been provided to me. Right here up above us, you're going to be seeing that price come up, and this is a average ballpark range. So yes, by the time this video comes out, I will hopefully, Lord willing, be in Texas getting some amazing content for y'all. So Thursday night's video is going to be a home that I've already recorded and uh, it's something, it's a big double wide, but then Saturday night is probably when I'll drop the first one. So y'all stay very close to the channel. The videos come out Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, 645. Hope every one of you have a blessed day and until Thursday night, stay safe and I will see y'all then. See ya.